Welcome back to Let's Play Castlevania, Lords of Shadow 2. I'm Burning Dog Face, and we've just made a very profitable visit to the uh, Chupacabra shop. I got tons of items, he got tons of experience points. Don't know what he does with them. And now we're off. We need to get back to the real world, so let's use this one instead of just running all that way back. Okay. This one is explicitly a dead end. I like that. Now where the fuck am I? Looks like it kicked me out in the same one. That sucks, because there were uh, ram demons here. Huh. I know there isn't, there's more than one of those, uh, wolf rings here, because I had one that spat me out right next to the, uh, Biochemic Corporation. You know, that one skin that makes it gives you like the white hair and the black outfit to make you look more like the original Dracula. It's not a bad look. It looks pretty good, but uh I feel like red is an important color to Gabriel. Better? Now you are no longer alive, and everything is great. Where the fuck am I going? Uh, that way, actually. Oh wait, no, I have to go around, don't I? We went out that way before. Got a few treasury dues. In the end, I bought two potions from the store because, well, you'd seen how long it went without me getting a single one. I wasn't sure when I would be able to get another one. There's that theme again.
I gotta say, this game, this series is some of the best music I've ever heard in a video game. Like, most games don't go for the thoughtful. Like, this is just ominous. Worrisome. As opposed to dynamic and action packed. It's interesting that those guys weren't there this time. They are pretty good at keeping me on my toes. I don't even remember seeing this ladder last time. Oh, yes. Oh, good. More of you guys. You're finished, Scott. Oh, God. Riot Mech. The military industry has designed a number of tools of death to give their troops a greater tactical advantage. But few are as twisted and destructive as the Riot Mech. The operator of this enormous two-legged tank can use a combination flamethrower, grenade launcher, and high-caliber machine gun to defeat a battalion of a hundred men armed to the teeth all by himself. The thick armor gives it total protection against impact, <laughs> it has a serious problem with its motor overheating. So to keep the mech from exploding, engineers have designed a solution via two fragile cooling pipes which are temporarily released whenever this becomes a problem. Spare no excuse, if there's, no, if there's room for another weapon, install it. Barnes Wallace, military engineer. See what he does here. Flamethrower, grenade launcher, and machine gun, really? Oh hey look, there was a uh, experience point in that uh, fence. You kicked your friend! Why? Are you not buddies? Could he potentially owe you money? Hate! Hold your position! Nah. Okay. Yes! He isn't human. You kind of noticed that, huh? Why won't he move? Ah, fuck! Dicks! I wanted to eat that guy. No! I'd use these, but they never seem to work against these guys. That was the... Do that! They fly out of reach! Mmm! Well, it worked well enough that time. Aww. Oh, that's neat. They can just... Oh, fuck me. Um... Damn it. Jesus. 
Jesus Christ. Okay, fuck you. Oh, Christ. Not want. Oh, my organs. My beautiful organs. You know how difficult it is to look this good at five. I don't know. What is it? A thousand. No, I'd say about a thousand twenty. Show up. No, not the cannon! Not the cannon! The cannon. Oh, he's going to hurt me. Ah! Oh, I hate this thing so much. Let's get the fuck away from this thing now. Oh, it dropped experience points. Ah! Oh! My hand. So if Zobek doesn't have the, uh, thing, is it gonna turn out to be the guy from the, uh, church? Oh, it's an angel on one side and a demon on the other. And the woman is tying a blindfold around her eyes. I was wondering when that was going to come up. Oh, awesome! Upgrade. Hold the X button longer to perform an expansive freezing blow after la landing the smashing stab. Fuck yes. Yes! Mmm! Achievement unlocked, initiated in mastery. Increase the mastery level of a weapon. It doesn't look any different, I think. It's hard to say. I, I swear the weapons looked di the uh, whip looked different when I used the Alistor uh, seal. The important thing is, I did it for reals, yo. I got my whip up to level ma mastery level two. High five! Alright, fine, be that way. Neat. Oh, I see, it's about the same amount of time as this. Oh, by the way, I figured out the other what I was doing wrong the other day. Uh, it's not left trigger, it's right trigger for this. So you select the, uh, the the fire bomb, the chaos bombs, and then you hold X. Oh, look at that! It did use up uh, magic.
Most moves don't use magic unless you connect with something. I guess that does. Well, I can't very well go that way. Oh, yes, I can. So let's go this way. Treasure. No, this just leads back here. Who fucking cares anymore? It's the end of the world. I wanna see if I can do it. No, no, never mind. I'm gonna loop all the way around again. I go where I please, sign. Thanks, me. Hey, I did that right, G Gabriel. You're the one who didn't grab on. That's better. I'll forgive it this time. Because I'm magnanimous like that. Subtle. Pretty sure it just transitioned into a different uh, set of areas. I wonder if they're going to do anything with the sun. You know, like a level where you're, uh, it's early morning and you have to stay in the shadows. Get the map. Scratch an itch on my eye. Yeah, I like when it's explicitly a dead end. Although it does raise the question of why that little thing exists in the first place. Hey, a memorial. I haven't seen one of these in a while. Yoink! Origins of the city. This street was once the heart of Dracula's castle. Destroyed by the Brotherhood of Light down to its foundations, today few places remain with structures standing from that time. The purpose of this memorial is that we never forget that the inner sanctum of the Prince of Darkness, the worst monster ever to walk the earth, stood here. We were able to defeat him then. Today we are able to live in peace in the same place where he terrorized the world. It is undoubtedly the greatest victory of the human race over the forces of darkness. Let us remember it, celebrate it, and remain alert. Hmm. Seems suspicious to me. Something like that doesn't just feel quite right. Oh yeah, it's because Dracula's right here. Oh yeah. This place.
my god. Ow, fuck. Tell you what, this time let's do that since it's the end of the video. Fuck you! And fuck you! Mmm, delicious! Fuck yeah! Maybe it'll be a chaos gem and I can upgrade both in the same session. That's always nice. Uh oh. Hey! You found five chaos gems. Your chaos magic capacity has increased. And there you go. The chupacabra has explicitly uh, aided in saving the world. Oh, I'd have thought about that guy. He looked. He looks like uh, the protagonist of an Assassin's Creed game if it was made by a Japanese developer. <laughs> Hooded man. A man with an unknown face walks swiftly through the city, avoiding the wandering dark forces. Zobek noticed the enormous power emanating from this being, a power different from that of, of Satan's acolytes, a power even more familiar. What is his identity? Where does his energy come from? What activities is he conducting in the city? Soon there will be an answer to all of these questions. Be careful, there is a tremendous power close to you, Zobek. Well, um, I look at that picture, and I can't help but notice the guy is using a fucking combat cross. So yeah, that's spoiler aside, uh, I'm guessing it's safe to say he goes in this section. Wait. Nobody confirmed that, by the way. Chaos wave. The mist form reacts with chaos power, enabling Dracula to carry out a sudden fiery charge in the direction selected. The flames break the defenses of all surrounding enemies. That sounds good. There's nothing like that here. I guess I need this first. Well, in any event, whether that guy is actually a Belmont, a member of the Brotherhood, or just an ironic evildoer, we'll find out next time on Let's Play Castlevania, Lords of Shadow 2. I'm Burning Dogface, and I'll see you then. Later!